Hi, this is Jim Watkins from ProServe Crane Group. Today we are going to check out a Euro Drive brake, see if, if it is actuated. First, you remove the cover from your brake. Set the cover aside. Now, as you can see, you have a brake rectifier and another terminal. We are checking your brake rectifier and see if it is actuating first. First, you apply power to the rectifier and then take in your meter and put it on bolt AC. You're taking your probe, put uh, your red probe on two, terminal two and your black on terminal three and what do we have? Can you see that? We have 239 volts. So we have power applying to the rectifier. Now the question is, do, is the rectifier bad or the brake coil bad? What we're gonna do first is remove the power to the brake. Make sure we have no power to the brake by checking terminal two and terminal three again. And we have no power. You're gonna remove the white wire from the rectifier. The red wire and the blue wire. And you wanna bring them out here so you can get to them. Now, I am going to put my black probe on my red wire. My white probe on the white wire. Changing my settings from volts AC to resistance of the omega sign. And I should be reading 171 ohms. I am reading right now 82, which tells me the rectifier, the brake coil is bad. But let's check the other side of the brake coil. So I remove the red probe from my white wire and connected to the blue wire. I should be reading 153 ohms. I am reading 306 ohm. Definitely the brake coil is bad and the brake coil needs to be changed out. 